What's going on YouTube? Today we are bringing you a rip of to the 2223 Tops Museum Collection UEFA Champions League. And as you can see, this is a single pack product. Uh, they were retailing on Tops site for $275. Uh, secondary market so far, they've seen them in the 300 to 330 range. Uh, don't know how long it's going to keep that price or if it's going to go up or go down. So it'll be interesting to watch. This is a hit heavy product. Uh, you only get eight cards in a pack. It is all Champions League. And the nice thing about this is you are guaranteed one autograph card, one autograph relic card, and one relic card. You also get one parallel. Uh, all of those, all the parallels in this set are numbered to 125 or less, um, and they go down to an emerald one of one. So let's take a look at what we get. So let's get this ripped and see how we do. Some nice uh, premium packaging here. We'll just set that off here to the side. See if they actually include any information on the package. It's going to be a little hard to see what this coloring doesn't look like anything useful. So let's rip it open and find out what this looks like. It's upside down. We start there with a Phil Foden. That's just the standard base card. A little thicker stock. I'll sleeve these up after we go through them. There's Pedri. From Barcelona. There's a Carvalho. This one is a parallel to 125. So this is what the copper parallel looks like. Not terribly different from the base card. But Carvalho rookie to 125, not bad at all. And there's our, it's like our auto, numbered to 99. That's the Amethyst of Furuashi. And I think the card on the back is another base card, so I want to pull that off real quick. It's a Frank Lampard. Set that up here as well. Musa Diaby, there's our autograph to 75. That's a sapphire. That should be, hopefully, um, well, we'll take a look at the last card here and then. Check that to see if it's game worn. This one, Alfonso Davies. That one numbered to 25. So this is the Ruby. So that's the lowest parallel we got there. It's a nice uh, D on the patch there. Let's take a look at the back of this real quick. That is match used memorabilia. But it is not from a specific match, event, or season, so that's a little unfortunate, but still nice that it's game used. Oh, we have a little card stuck there. All right, there we go. There's a Mason Mount to 199. It's a bright yellow. Let's see if this one is player worn memorabilia but not from any specific match. And this one as well, player-worn memorabilia. So 
at least everything's player worn maybe not match specific stuff so a lot of it probably just something a player wore at one point warm-ups or unfortunately even in a uh even just in an office somewhere before they cut it apart and put it in cards but that's kind of how the hobby works unfortunately so um quick recap here we'll just look through these our base cards again lampard pedri phil foden the carvalho rookie 125 the davies 225 patch that's the ruby nice looking patch too and we got the diaby autograph mem and this is the archival autographs rokashi to 99 it's a pretty looking card the camera's actually not doing it much justice unfortunately but very nice and then the mason mount now uh man united of course no longer with chelsea but interesting product um small checklist a lot of big names overall um i think it's a really nice product for for this year's set i like the designs they look really great in person even better than kind of what the camera's picking up and showing on them unfortunately but definitely something may pick up more of uh really likable set the only downside for me is that there aren't much in the way of Arsenal players except for Kai Havertz, our recent transfer, and of course he's going to be in a Chelsea jersey in the set, but next year's set will have some gunners in it, fortunately. But if you like the product openings, feel free to like and subscribe. Would be grateful for that. Helps us grow the channel. Helps us keep bringing you these. Uh, we're going to have a couple more videos coming this week. We've got some NBA product we're going to be ripping, uh, as well as possibly some other... Uh, some one more soccer product uh, here in the next week that I think we're going to do. And there are a couple releases coming up in August that we're definitely looking forward to. And we'll probably do a giveaway around the end of August. So pay attention to the channel for the information coming from that. Thanks for watching.